What's up everybody, Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2022 President's Choice Exclusive 4th Edition. One box break, random hit number two just sold out. So four total spots, <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, we'll showcase the hits out of the box. Then we'll randomize the list of names and the hits. Whatever you match up with is what you get. Now, of course, Brittany actually bought out all the spots. And we're putting Steve Locke's name in there to see potentially what he would have got. But uh, Brittany got all of them. And since it is technically a personal, you know, Sometimes we do this, sometimes we don't, but for this one, I'll do it. I'll let Brittany choose a box. So I have five on the left, one, two, three, four, five, and then four on the right, if you want to choose one of those boxes. Let me know, Brandon, which box would you like? <clears throat> Do on the right second down, okay. One, two. So there you go, right here. Also, too, these were number 95 out of 250. I guess I should have shown that, but same thing, I guess. Still random. All right, here we go. All right, ready? We got one. We got another one of these bulging twines. It's Ted Kennedy bulging twine. Look at that, dude. Dang. Four out of five. And this was a piece of game used nap from the Montreal Forum. Authenticity of the memorabilia is guaranteed by President's Choice. And uh, 1951 Stanley Cup final between Toronto and Montreal saw all five games finish in overtime. Kennedy scored the overtime winner in Game Three at 4:47. Of the first overtime period in Montreal. So there you go. Next one. Is a holding the stick. Three of ten president's choice. Did they not get the picture to this guy? Ilya? Mike Avev? It's like, it's like the part of the stick right there. Uh, I don't know if that was the same Ted Kennedy. Was it? I don't think so. Was that? Does that look like him? I don't think so. Though. And we have Steve Shutt, game used cup winner. Three of ten. Need something to wow us here. Need something to wow us. Last one yesterday I had a one on one at the bottom, so hopefully that's what this is too. And it is a one of one. That's a Ryan Murray stick handle. That's actually pretty cool. Game use Ryan Murray stick. Not too shabby. Okay, not bad. The piece of Murray stick there. Alright, so we got a twine, uh Elia, shut, and a Murray. 
stick handle 101. So there you go. Now, uh, let's see what potentially who would have got what. Will it be Brittany or will it be uh, Steve? Although I think it is already, anyways. But let's see. Move that over here. And let's switch scenes really quick. So the first one we'll put Ted Kennedy. Alright. Ilya. This is for entertainment purposes only, Steve. Alright, let's see what you would have walked away with. We have Steve Shut. And then we have Ryan Murray. Just put the names. Alright, let's check it out. Let's see. Let's see. Two and a five or one and a five six times. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh, splitting it right there. Ooh. 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 Splitting it. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ryan Murray at the top. Down to Steve Shutt. So, Steve, you would have gotten the Ryan Murray. One of one. Look at that. Woohoo! Brittany's getting the Elia. Brittany's getting the Ted Kennedy. And then, uh, Steve, you'd be getting the, uh, the uh, Steve shot. Look at that. There you go. So I appreciate it, guys. Uh, so I will post up another one of these. You know, it's, it's a fun break. It's not too pricey. I mean, obviously, every box will be different. But um, I, I think there are some pretty good hits in here. I mean, as you can see, kind of some sell sheets. And it looks like there's autographs, too. So there might not be a lot of autographs, but there definitely is autographs in here. And some of these guys are obviously more old school guys than anything. So it's kind of cool to see that because, you know, with Upper Deck and all that, they don't really go too far back. And I think that's what Leaf and obviously this this company here was kind of kind of striving on was like, you know, bringing back some of these older players that people don't really see too much memorabilia stuff out there for them. And, uh, yeah, it's quick. It's fun. And you're guaranteed something. So next one's in the store, guys. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.